Hey, what's up everybody? My name's Russ, rwgresearch.com and quantumgravityresearch.org. So I had to go get some copper clad board today uh, because I didn't want to wait and I didn't want to spend a lot of money online. So I drove out to Apex Electronics, the same place I got that world's smallest magnet wire that I found. Uh, if you haven't seen that video, I'll link it in the description. However, I wanted to show you what I got because it's ridiculous. So I think from now on, if I go to Apex Electronics, I'm just going to make a video if it's something interesting, of course, that I get. So let's have a look. So this is what I got. I got this many copper clad boards. And they're double sided. I actually went to try to find single sided and couldn't find them. And this is what I found. This was in the sort of the scrap box. They called it the leftovers or scrap pieces or whatever. This actually does have a part number on it if you want to look it up. Maybe you'll find out when, where, who, and why. Uh, this is also some cutoffs. There are four pieces here. And then this is pretty unique. So this one actually has the sticker on it. There's the sticker number. I do not know what this exactly is, but it's got hole punches in it, almost as if it fits in a binder. And it's really, really, really thin. It is like super, super thin. Pretty interesting stuff. I bought three of those because, again, it's by the pound and these don't weigh very much. And I thought if I made some uh, interesting circuit boards where I needed some small stuff, then I've got it. And then here are the full sheets. So these are 12 by 12, and these are the thick boys. These are very, very thick pieces. Again, double-sided, and there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are eight of them that I purchased. So, yeah. Now, here's the interesting thing about this. I spent a total on copper clad board only of $20. <laughs> what? Double sided circuit board, 12 by 12 pieces, eight of them. Go look how much those cost. I'm not even gonna show it in this video. I'm gonna let you go look. You tell me how much they cost in the comments. It's ridiculous. And that's a big time score, a huge win for us. Now I can cut as many circuit boards as I want and screw them all up and it only cost me 20 bucks. That's crazy. That's crazy and the bad thing is I actually purchased some online not too long ago. I think I bought two or three of them online, these one foot by one foot double sided boards, which was a, now I shouldn't have done that but I didn't realize it at the time. Oh well, shoot yourself in the foot sometimes. I also got some ICs. These are um, 74F02s. Well, let's see if we can get a focus on there. Uh, these are, uh, I believe, quad uh, and or, or XOR gates. Um, I can't remember, but I got these because I need them for the 3D printer. And then I got some blanks. Um, I actually spent $5 on this whole thing. There's like, what, I don't know, 15 or 20 of them in there. Uh, and then also I got some of these standoffs because I need them for Stan Myers projects. These are not quite the same ones, but they're very similar. So this is a uh, package of 100 and it cost me 10 bucks, which was a little more than I wanted to pay, but if you go look these up, they're very expensive. Unfortunately, the part numbers are about gone. So anyway, all right, well that's it. I just wanted to give you guys a little Apex Electronics score. Freaking awesome, man. That's crazy. Okay, peace and love, let me know what you think. If you want me to make more of these when I find good stuff like this, well, let me know. I got the OSD up here because I'm going to be cutting circuit boards for an actual project here at work. Got a new power supply. Thanks to uh, my friend. That's a 90 amp 12 volt output DC supply. Look how small it is. More of that coming up in the future. I'll show you more about that. Okay, new vacuum cleaner that I got out of the trash for sucking up the... Uh, sucking up the goodness here. So I'm going to be building the the little uh, IC with uh, with these chips to make that thing run. Anyway. Anyway, a little update while I'm just liver labbering, glabbering, glabbering, rabbiting. Peace and love. God bless.
Rock on. Bye.